Hey guys, what's going on? Today we're going to be talking about the new JP data download that just came out on Dokkan Battle. So, um, first off, it came out today. It's the 3.13.0 release, alright? So, from the data download, the assets are, let's see, we get uh, just two tickets for, I guess, a banner. Uh, new banners are available. Seven tickets for an SR plus guaranteed banner. LRs are in it. One ticket for the guaranteed SSR banner. LR, L, all the LRs are in it as well. Various changes, friend list increased to level like 100 actual slots. You can now set a unit that will show up in your friends list. I'll, go, I'll talk about that in a minute. You don't actually set a unit, um, but we have new animations and we have a possible guaranteed LR, which I did not click on before. Um, so it looks like there is uh, an LR or something or other going on right now. Um, we also have the new animations. This is one of the new animations that you see over here. It goes to Super Vegito, which is pretty awesome. I don't know if this means guaranteed LR animation, or if it just means that um, we have a banner that you get to do one full, one actual summon. Oh, what does that look at? Like, LR. Oh, we have a new LR animation, so that way you let, it lets you know if that one's going to go to LR. Okay, that's pretty damn cool. That's actually the first time that I saw that, so. Um, awesome. Oh, look at that. Cool. Legendary character coming. Huh, interesting. So actually, that might be a specific banner. We'll have to wait and see. It's currently not available. Notification update for version 3.1.0. This is the biggest thing, and I want to get this out of the way because I know a lot of you are going to be clicking on the video because I'm going to purposely state in the title of the video uh, about the friends thing. And I don't want it to be a baby thing where you have to wait to the end, so let's get it over in the beginning. We have a new friends list option where you could select, the, well, search for the type of friend that you want. Yes, they heard our complaints for the last year, year and a half. Took them that long. Come on, Bandai. Come on, work on this a little bit better for us. Really easy to implement. You used existing mechanics to make it better. You can now search for a specific friend that you want in here. Where I'm actually going to show you a little bit of gameplay on how to do that. Like, not actually play a level, but I'm going to show you what it looks like. Um, it's also here. I got it on dbz.space. That way we have the official and stuff. By the way, shout out to DBZ, uh, dbz.space. Shout out to Twitter. Shout out to the Reddit for all this awesome, awesome information. I'm going to switch over to my Dokkan recording really quick. Well, as you see over here, I am on the JP side of Dokkan. We're going to go over here into the list, well, into an event. We're just going to click on an event, the pen, and you select Super 100. Now, on the bottom right-hand side, we have the option. Now we can finally search. So if I'm looking like this is Super Saiyan 3 category because I brought my, brought my Bardock. It's the only one I also know because it's, uh, you know, in Japanese. <laughs> uh, there's a 3 in it. Now I can search for Super Saiyan 3s. It's not going to specifically show you uh, all leaders. It's going to show people part of that category. I could also go in here, and I know Intelligence is in the middle, and Super for Bardocks. So now I could actually specifically search for Bardock. That's awesome. Now I could also go over here. I could remove Super Saiyan 3 and Big Bad Bosses. Let's see what we got over here. I don't mean the, it's the boss leader skill, so I have no idea if there's actually going to be a part of it. So anyone part of the category is going to now show up. If I'm specifically looking for Broly's, I can go over here to uh, set it for extreme type uh, and strength types, part of the boss category. Now all Broly's are going to show up. I'll engine number, I guess, too. Um, so that's damn pretty awesome, and it's definitely gonna help out in the World Tournament as well, because I can't wait for them to come to Global. Damn it, hurry up, come to Global. Um, <laughs> but, um, yeah, you can actually do that, so that's pretty damn awesome. I just wanted to make sure I got that out there for you really quick. Let's jump back over to the rest of the information. Alright, so, uh, new JP Summon assets. We have character pop-ups, flying characters, plus LR coming. I guess that's the banner I talked about. We have new voice clips, which we will not be uh, playing over here, but it looks like we have new Goku. Uh, voice clips, new Vegeta voice clips. Vegeta and Goku also look like it's going to be part of the summoning animation, so that's going to be awesome. Um, this is another part of the summoning animation, which you probably already saw, and this is the Vegito with the uh, actual earring. Uh, let's see over here. These are actual clips of uh, the new animations that are going to be available for summons. Um, I'm going to try, I mean, it, it's really tiny. Uh, it looks like the Super Saiyan God is going to be part of um, SSRs, maybe SSRs, who knows, maybe LRs, who knows, we'll have to see. Um, we have the Vegito, we have Goku, Vegito, um, we also have Vegeta and Goku, oh, actually, I guess that's actually the um, earrings that might be just part of Patara Fusion. It looks like we're also, other than like, uh, th uh, bye guys, it's over Frieza, thank you Dragon Balls, it looks like we're also getting an Oolong. I, I don't know what the heck this is all the way on the right hand side, maybe if you guys know you can let me know. Um, I don't know what the heck that is, that, that it looks like someone's angry, I don't know what the heck that is. Um, it looks like we have a rainbow animation over here, something like that. Um, and it also looks like we have some other flying animations, which was also brought out. So again, thank you to the Red for all that information. I don't know what the heck that's all about. Um, it looks like it's going to be Hercule and Boo. Uh, maybe it's something specific to an LR, an existing LR, the existing LR. 
Uh, this also looks like it's going... Oh, this is for uh, Tian Shinhan. So it looks like we might be getting new animations across the board. So we'll have to wait and see. Um, it also looks like legendary character coming, legendary character coming. So I guess this is from what we were talking about from the actual campaign. So that's pretty awesome. Can't wait for that to come out. Obviously, when that information becomes available, I will let you know. Um, new tech banner is currently available. You get two Elder Kai's per this. Now, what's interesting on this, the Angel Frieza technique is in the banner. That's the other world Frieza. So I'm over here on dbz.space real quick. Let's go ahead and refresh it so it takes up the full screen. You go over here and we go to normal. This is the that Angel Frieza. So if the other world tournament guys are now going to be available in the banners, they better be doing that on global. I'll tell you that much right now. I'm going to be a little bit upset if that's the case for JP only. We've had that those other world tournament guys uh, just uh, exclusive for one year on that one banner, and we couldn't get them again. And now it's going to be available on other banners. And on top of that, that means they better do that to Arale as well, because I never got the physical one, and I want that damn physical one. Anyway. <laughs> Um, we have a new warning when SSRs are being trained in. It's a different warning. It has little exclamation points all in red and whatnot. So when you go to train them, so that's awesome. Um, we have a new effect for Goku and Vegeta on Battlefield. Now, again, I don't play Battlefield, so um, that, that's something new to me. I don't know. But if you go over here, look at that. It looks like the lightning actually shows some stuff. There's like It looks like they're about to fight or something like that. It's some weird uh, electricity. I think they're going for electricity anyway. Um, there, this other banner's up for, looks like the Bardock, it has Kefla, Khalifla, Super Saiyan 3, Goku, and Super Saiyan 3, Vegeta, so that's damn pretty cool, there's nothing else really specific about that, looks like guaranteed SSR as normal, looks like you get SSR tickets as well, I guess that's what that is, um, and also, finally, Baba Shop, we have the ability to Baba more than one item, the same thing goes with characters, finally, how long, why, why did this take you so long, Bandai, Jesus, I just went in there, I did the characters, I ended up bobbing like, I don't know, 20-something characters, something like that, just because I, I could do it. Um, you can also do that now, obviously, with the medals, so that's going to come in handy. For those of you, you know, who I've talked to, who you watch my videos on a daily, regular basis, um, remember, when it comes to the fruit of the tree and might, that's going to help us out so much. You can literally just go bobble all them damn fruits instead of having to spend all your time doing it, you just do it all at one time. And then you can go and rerun the level, get your turlaces, and get those uh, fruits of the tree and might to increase your bobble point. But um, yeah, guys, that's it. That's all the information I have for you right now. If I missed anything, if I overlooked anything, if there's any type of data dump that I did not, that I was not made privy to at the time of this video, I apologize, and I will make sure to do a follow-up video to that. But as of right now, I saw it last night around 2 o'clock in the morning when it finally became available or whatever time it was. I just didn't want to wait for there to be a whole bunch of information posted up, and it looks like this is what was there. Um, so again, when more information comes out, I'll definitely let you know. But anyway, guys, thank you for joining me here today. I'll catch you all later. Peace.